Okay, 2014 oil change. What I do is I jack up the car, just put a couple 2x4s under the tire, lower it a bit, because the car's high anyway, you know, so if it falls, you know, you're not really working under it, it's not that big a deal. What I do is use a 15 millimeter, um, you know, socket here, remove the drain plug, and I use a paper towel to clean it off really good. The oil's already been done. You don't need to you know, watch me drain the oil. And then what you do is just put the drain plug back in, tighten it up. To remove it, you pull it toward the front of the car. To remove it toward the front of the car, to tighten it toward the back of the car. All there is to that. And then, oh, and then, you come up here to remove this right here. It's a uh, 15 sixteenths right there. And all you do is just take the old filter off. The gasket, you know, it comes with it. I replace it every other time. It's not that big a deal. Um, I wouldn't do more than that because I heard from Chevrolet, they do it about every two or three times. Anyway, um, and then when you fill it, I've learned that if you have your funnel and put your funnel in there and just pour the oil in, it overflows a bit. So I hold it up, hold it up just a bit and pour it in slowly. Also, this is a six cylinder. I use, um, I use full synthetic. And what I do is I buy them in five uh, quarts. And what, what I do is first time I sit there and I put one quart in and then I'll put in the other, um, or it takes six quarts, I'm sorry. Put one quart in, and then I'll put five quarts in, because that's what this holds, is six quarts. And personally, I just use full synthetic. You know, it calls for synthetic blend, but you know what, eh. Synthetic blend, according to the oil manufacturers, they're going, you know what, it could have one part synthetic and the rest conventional. So it's like, I can afford synthetic, so I just use it. Not a big deal. Plus the Corvette uses it too. Anyway, all there is to it, and then when you tighten this up, don't over tighten it. The reason being is, because there's no gasket, no nothing, don't overkill it. Get it just very snug. You know, don't torque it down. And then the oil plug, same thing. Don't over tighten it. That's all there is to it. Very simple. All right, good luck to you. Works for me. Hope it works for you.